Hi! Ooh, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel if you are new. Today we're doing stuff. What are we doing? Putting makeup on. Right. That's what we do here. I was watching Samantha Ravindal do this video where, oh lord, she put her face base on basically in reverse, like all of her contour, highlight, blush, concealer, everything on underneath her foundation. And it, one, looked absolutely gorgeous. Her friend who taught her about that may possibly be the smartest woman in the world. So here's my thing. I love this CoverGirl True Blend foundation, um, but I cannot put powders on top of it. And I'm not just talking like setting it. I legit cannot use bronzer, blush, highlight, anything that is a powder on top of this shit. So I'm all for a foundation that doesn't need to be set. Uh, but I also love my powder highlight. When I saw how beautiful and natural all of this looked, I was like, you know what? That might be perfect for this because it is not a super high coverage foundation. Um, I'm kind of steered away from that road. Country roads, take me home. I digress. So I'm going out to dinner. I wanted to look fancy. We're gonna do a backwards face. Sort of. Oh, I'm gonna start by priming. I'm using my teensy weensy little baby of a thing for the professional. That foundation really, really has a bad habit of showing off texture. Eliminate that by filling in the tiny holes on my face. And now I'm going to conceal. I'm using the teensy weensy little baby. <laughs> tiny makeup, love it. Of the Tarte Shape Tape. Okay, so I do not have a liquid bronzer. Um, I do have a cream contour stick, which is what I'm gonna use to contour. I'm using the NYX uh, Wonder Stick, and I'm just gonna put some stuff here. So the places where I'm not going to be using a blinding highlight, like a more natural, just light in the face, I'm going to use the lighter end of the stick. So in the center of my nose and just up on my fur heads right here. And for blush, I'm going to go into the Space Case Cream Blush. I'm going to go in with my finger first and I'm going to pat that on where I want it. And then stamp the rest of that out. This feels crazy. And now I'm gonna go in with my Essence Make Me Glow highlighter. Get like a shit ton on here, I guess. Moment of truth. We're going in with the foundation. I'm gonna, I guess, just dot this on at first. Wow, this is amazing. Okay, I feel like it did work, but I think I could have gone a little tad bit more ham on the under layers because I think I was holding back uh, and it is showing through, but it's not, I mean the highlighter, yes, but I could have gone with more blush and a little bit more contour. I think as a whole, this clearly does work and it looks really nice. So I think I'm going to go over this with some Milky Mist just to get a bit more dew going on. I see a difference. I think this is nice. I'm probably going to do this a lot. I'm going to throw on the rest of my face. We'll be right back. Alrighty. I'm so happy with this. I like it. Definitely need more underneath though. Freaking effortless, yo. Do people still say that? Is it still cool to end things with yo? I'm too old for this. So there we go. That is my entire face done. I'm starving to death. So I 
I'm gonna go to a nice restaurant and put some food in my face. Uh, uh, like this video if you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you like it here. And we'll see you in the next one. Wow.